Hey guys, it's Sarah and Oz, and um, we're just going to come in for a really quick update. I'm still having trouble uploading videos, so it's not going to be very long, but there are a few things I want to talk about. Um, so let me jump into the numbers. I started my journey on April the 26th, 2012. At that time, I weighed in at, <laughs> at 357 pounds. Um, that was in 2012. Last year at this time, I was 180, 181, um, and then we got pregnant. And uh, we found out on January 4th of 2013 we were pregnant. Um, he was born September the 16th, uh, 2014. So he's exactly four months old today. And I weighed in at 224 pounds, point two, uh, two days ago. Not yesterday, but the day before. Um, yeah, yeah. Here's the thing. You know how my body loved 180, 181? My skinny body did. Well, my fat body loves 223 to 224. Doesn't matter what I eat, what I do, what I don't eat, how much I eat, how little I eat, how much I exercise, all the water I intake, I'm staying there. So I'm concerned about that. Um, but on the flip side, you know, 220s is, I don't want to stay in the 220s, but I will say that it is, you know, I used to be a lot bigger. So um, I'm just trying to be really positive. Last week and this week, the first of this week, <clears throat> I really, really, really started putting stuff in my fitness pal. Um, and even before I was doing that, I was really watching my calorie intake, watching my, trying to watch my carbs, trying to, are oh, you going to talk now? Trying to decide, you see that baby? Who's that baby? Trying to um, really pay attention and watch what I was eating. Um, Tuesday of this week? I started freaking out because I realized that the last two days my milk had production been really low. We we're exclusively pumping, and so um, I do, really don't have a lot of wiggle room as far as um, losing milk goes. And we were having to supplement a little more, which we do from time to time when he has a big day, like where he wants to eat a lot. Um, sometimes we just have to supplement. I just can't keep up. So, I started getting freaked out, I started really worrying, I started paying attention to what I was eating, and I started, you know, realizing, I was like, you know what, I really started exercising, and I really started watching my weight. So, I'm kind of at this standstill now, um, I really want to be in the weight loss phase, I really want to be losing the weight, I really wanted to be under 200, I really wanted to be, I really wanted to lose 30 pounds by May the 1st, because that's when I go back to see my doctor um, at Vanderbilt. And I've been thinking that was totally doable. You know, that's like four months or five months away. But now I'm thinking, I don't know if I can do it. Um, because I really saw a re major reduction in my milk. So, the last two, three days. That happened on Monday or Tuesday. I realized it. So, since then, I've really been putting stuff in my fitness pal, but really not... Um, Really not focusing so much. We had shots today, so we're not our 100% best. Um, I really have been focusing less. Anyways, I still continued to work out. Um, I did not run. I had been running. I quit running. Um, and I've really been trying to keep my water intake up. And, and maybe that was it. Maybe because I was exercising, even though my water was fairly high, I was not compensating for the water I was losing during workouts. I don't know. I just know it went down and I can't afford at this point for to lose any milk. Um, the good news is, is he'll be six months soon. In six months we can start introducing some solids and so he will start taking less. So yeah, I'm a little discouraged about that. I'm trying not to beat myself up because I know that's what's best for him. That is so pitiful. Mama just gave me some time and all. Yeah, I just pitiful boy when I don't feel good. Anyways, all right, I guess I'm gonna jump off here, but that's basically it. Um, you know, I'm kind of, I'm in that zone of not, not really knowing what to do, trying to. <laughs> okay, guys, bye. Okay, bye.